A new program is helping people get fit and have their health questions answered free of charge. Every Tuesday, the Market YMCA is hosting Ask the Doctors on the Move. TV6's Rebecca Himmelstein explains how walking with a group of people can benefit you in tonight's Your Health Matters. So my problem with the Fitbit is that it's all about quantity and not about quality. It can be hard to find time in your schedule to exercise, let alone squeeze in a doctor's visit. But the YMCA has found a way to accomplish both. It's great to do in the morning because it can kickstart your metabolism for the day and help you feel active and energetic for the rest of the day. Ask the Doctors on the Move is a morning walk with area physicians. You can ask doctors any questions you may have in a more casual setting than a doctor's office, all while exercising. It's a walk, but for a lot of people, it's more than what they would otherwise have done today or certainly this early in the day. So it's a great start. On the days when I get up and walk, it's certainly a better day. Just the whole attitude, um, how you feel about the day, and knowing that at least some exercise is already taken care of. By 5 o'clock or 6 o'clock, you kind of have other things on your mind. Each week, a guest physician will speak on a topic in their field, but the walkers can ask them anything. Let's give people a chance to ask some of those questions that maybe they don't get a chance to ask when they're in a more rushed kind of doctor's visit. It feels so much more personal. I mean, to have 45 minutes to be walking with someone rather than sitting with a white coat in the office, very approachable. And walking is a great way to start your day. Walking is benefit for weight control, for your heart health. It's low impact, so it's good for arthritis and joints. For the rest of today and into tomorrow, my body is better equipped at burning blood sugar. Ask the Doctors on the Move meets at the YMCA on Tuesday mornings at 7 a.m. through August 25th. Rebecca Himmelstein, TV6 News, Marquette.